Hey what's up guys welcome to Fine Gap YouTube channel and in today's video we will create a custom toolbar in Android Studio here you can see that we have create a toolbar and also we will create a menu with our custom toolbar when you will click on the menu you will see two items new group and web whatsapp when you will click on any item you will see a toast message in your Android app so guys video is going to be more important and before start please I request you to subscribe to our YouTube channel to stay up to date with amazing programming videos let's start so guys first of all here you can see that we have create a simple android studio project first of all you have to click on resource folder values themes and themes.xml and you have to convert this dark action bar to no action bar what this code will do this will remove our the default action bar that android studio gives us now simply just close this file and now guys you have to right click on the layout folder click on new layout resource file here we have to type here toolbar underscore layout and uh, convert this root level element to linear layout and friends press ok button so here you can see that this is our simple layout file click on the split button and uh, again click on the design button and first of all we have to search here toolbar and we have to drag our toolbar here at this position so you can see that this is our simple toolbar guys click on the split button and here what we, we will do we will remove these three lines and copy our this line and paste it at this position also we will remove this one add this one and guys we have to also remove this line this will remove our all the error okay guys next you have to remove this line and you have to type here add style theme overlay dot app compact dot dark and next you have to type here pop-up theme at the rate of style overlay dot app compact dot light so guys you have to write these two lines and in the comment minutes i will tell you what is the purpose of these two lines let's move on now guys you have to open your main activity and open it click on the its split section and change this constraint layout to relative layout and also guys we have to remove this text view because we don't need this and here we have to type include layout is equal to add the rate of layout toolbar so we have to add this add this line and guys we have to add one more line which is id so id will be id would be toolbar put forward slash at the end that's it guys now open the main activity and here we have to type toolbar is equal toolbar toolbar is equal to find view by id r dot id dot toolbar so we just have initialize our toolbar inside our main activity and next guys we have to type here uh set so, uh, sorry first of all we have to put semicolon at the end because this is java not kotlin and now we have to type here set support action bar is equal to toolbar you can see that it is giving us an error you just have to type here and remove this toolbar and again when you will start typing you have to select this toolbar android x dot app compact dot widget so this one now you can see that our app ha our our error have been removed now let me run the app so i can show you the current output so guys here you can see that our app have been run and we have simple toolbar but there is we have missed our menu so guys we have not missed it we don't have create this so let's just code for our menu so you just have to type here first of all i'm going to cross cross this and guys here we have to type on on create option menu and we have to remove this line from super to last and we have to type here true here we have to type get menu inflator dot inflate r dot menu dot so guys first of all we have to create the menu to create the menu first of all right click on the resource folder new android resource directory and from here we have to choose the menu you can see that directory name is uh, automatically change and we have to press the ok button again right click on the menu folder and new menu resource file and uh, i'm going to name this file toolbar underscore menu that's it press on ok button so here you can see that our menu file is created now just drag and drop a menu item and again drop the second menu item click on split button guys here we have to make some changes we have to give an id to our both items so we can access them in our java file so we have to type here id uh, like new underscore group and we have to type here id web underscore whatsapp that's it guys our menu file have been created and now again guys at this position we have to type here r dot menu dot toolbar underscore menu type comma space and guys we just have to copy this menu and paste this at this position so we have to write our code this code will create our three dots and our menu but now we want we have to write a code when user will click on a menu 
menu item what we have to do so let's start so guys we have to type here on option item selected this one and again we have to remove this code and type here true and inside this we have to write a switch statement switch statement is same like the if statement and uh, i'm going to teach you the syntax of switch statement so you have to type here switch item dot get item id mid braces and inside this switch statement we have to type here our case r dot id dot new group colon and first of all we have to type here break okay on the click of new group what will happen we will just so show a simple toast message but you can perform the activity according to your choice and at the second position again we have to type here the case r dot id dot web underscore whatsapp again we have to guys type here break and at last we have to type here default and again guys we have to type here break so the default statement in switch statement is used when our first case will not be true and our second case will not be true the defaults the code inside our default statement will be executed okay guys because we want to show a simple toast message to our user when user will click on the new group or web whatsapp so i just have to type here the toast message code so we have to type here toast and uh, you clicked new group we have to type here c length short show and again guys we have to just copy this one and paste this at this position our code has been completed now let me let me run the app so i can show you the output so we have to click at pixel 4 and click on play button so guys here you can see that our app have been run successfully and when i will click on these three dots you can you can see here item and item and when you will click on the first item here you will show a toast message you click the new group and when you will click the second item you will see a second toast message you click new group so if you want to change these names you just have to open the toolbar menu file and here guys we have to type here new group and in the second item we have to type web whatsapp that's it now let me again run the app so guys here you can see that we have run our app and now when i will open our menu you can see that new group and web dot whatsapp and when you will click on each on any item you will see a toast message so guys i hope you must enjoy this video if you have any question related to this tutorial you can ask us in the comment section we will try to answer your question and please subscribe to our youtube channel because this type of videos will help you to improve your coding knowledge and share this video with your those friends who want to learn android apps to development and finally thanks for watching